Hey collective, it's your girl. It's your girl Stace. From the Vine Goddess Tarot, Oracle Tarot readings, whichever one you show you pick up on. I'm here to do another reading. Because I feel like it. I'm a little you know, discombobulated because like I was sitting here and I was um you know just playing with the cards a little bit, seeing what the energy was, picking up on the energy, you know what I'm saying? And I keep picking up on this energy of somebody wanting to tell you something, right? Somebody want to tell you something about someone taking some kind of money from you. Keeping some kind of money hidden from you. Alright? And it's coming because whoever this is that's in your energy, they, ha they, they want to tell you. They want to share. But you see, they had a part to play in it as well. And that's what's keeping this somebody from... from um, sharing this information with you but I think spirits working on them mm-hmm spirits working on them look somebody held back some money from you I ain't lying could be a queen of wands Aries Leo Sagittarius take it how it resonates look at that look at spirit look and that's the truth <laughs> could have been a queen of wands that's holding back some finances from you that's trying to keep some finances hidden from you mm-hmm Yep, this person could have uh, vitiligo. That's that skin disease mm -hmm, that changes the skin color. Mm -hmm. That's a feminine. Somebody could have a black cat. Somebody could have Leo highly aspected in their chart. Okay, take it how it resonates. Somebody could like sunflowers. What's this message? Look, the Queen of Wands. So it came right back out. You know the truth. And you're speaking the truth. Yep, and somebody's watching you. You hear me? Somebody's watching. Mm -hmm, because they know justice is here. They know there was an injustice here and that it's going to have to be made right. Mm hmm. Spirit, what's going on here? Somebody could have brown hair, wear glasses. This is the one. Mm-hmm. Holding on some money of yours. Thank you, Spirit. Could be working with the Queen of Pinnacle, Queen of Wands. Or this could be the Queen of Wands. Take it how it resonates. Alright. Somebody could live at a distance from you. Yeah. They sitting on your money. Mm-hmm. Spirit, what's this message? Family. Look at that. Family. Mm-hmm. This could be somebody also that you have children with. This could be a parent as well or some kind of elderly person that's in your life that was supposed to be loyal to you. Mm-hmm. You could have a chat, like I already said. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Somebody could have tried to take your child from you. Because with this energy, see how she's holding out your baby, how she's holding, like, pulling away with him. Somebody could have tried to take your child from you. Mm-hmm. Whoever this man is that's, that's in your face, and you got this woman behind, like, this is... This is the person I feel like is pushing this narrative. Because see, she's sitting behind this man. This is somebody that's loyal. You see, they listen to this person. They take direction from this person. You hear me? Thank you, spirit. Listen. To hide something. Listen. I'm telling you. Somebody, they hiding something. Yep, it's hidden. They don't want you to find out about it. But they have been collaborating together. This woman here is the one that's that's calling all the shots. Mm-hmm. Yep. She's the one that has them all in control, all at her beck and command. Thank you, Spirit. Mm-hmm. This could be a mother figure, a parental figure. Listen. The death card. Cause an ending. Yes. Yep, they wanted to cause an ending to you. 
Eight of Pentacles to your work, to whatever it is you work on, could possibly be your job. You could do something online that could bring you in finances. They want to cause an end to that. Mm -hmm. Because you speak the truth. Come on, spirit. Yep, they want to cause an end to that, to that, to you speaking the truth. We have a, a older woman, a younger woman, and a child that's asking for forgiveness. And this, this one right here, this one's ashamed. This one's begging for forgiveness because they don't want to go. They don't want to be next. You hear me? And then there's a child. This could be um, a father figure. But whoever this is, they crowned them, fell off. You hear me? There's an, some kind of ending. Somebody's ashamed. And this other woman is begging for forgiveness. I told you. Mm -hmm. There could have been a child that was uh, conceived out of this situation. And this is what this woman could be ashamed of. Somebody is. Yep, they in their head. They stuck. Mm hmm. Well, this could be you, collective. Take it how it resonates. The love is on the bottom. A choice. Justice. Yes. They made a choice. Justice is going to be somebody's in their head. Somebody could have hooked up with somebody as well. Mm hmm. Chariot. Justice. Justice is you move forward, you keep going. Mm hmm. What was this message? But some they've been trying to keep this hidden too. Somebody could have there could have been definitely two people that were um sleeping around under the under this guise of the darkness as well. This is this is something that could be coming about to come to uh to light because they've been trying to keep this hidden. They've been trying to keep it hidden. Trying to avoid being left out in the cold. Trying to avoid being, um, uh, what's the word? Exposed. That's what I'm hearing. They don't want to be exposed. I mean, if you, whatever you're doing in the dark, we don't want nobody to see it. Why doing it? Why you doing it? Why you got to sneak and do it? You know what I'm saying? Why you got to keep it hidden? Right? If it's all good, right? Spirit, what's this message? Mm, 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 mm. Betrayal. They betrayed you. Yep, and they're gonna want your forgiveness. They, there's some people that that ha, that are walking around right now full of shame and regret and remorse, and they begging. I see people like begging God for forgiveness. Mm, mm, mm. Ten of Swords, King of Cups in reverse. Mm, mm, mm. Four Swords in reverse. This is somebody that don't have the sin. This is somebody that don't have no remorse about what they've done. You hear me? None. No remorse. No get. No 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 um regret. No no guilt or shame around it. Listen, cause it's the truth. Mhm. Mm they ain't got no no remorse. This is somebody that really never even had any emotions for you. This could be somebody that you dealt with that was very closed off emotionally. Okay, something that they did though, they don't want that shit to come out. They got some serious regret. This is somebody that's so much in their pride and ego. You hear me? Mm hmm. With this moon in reverse, they want to keep that shit hidden. Somebody, somebody's regretting about something that they did impulsively. You hear me? They did it without thinking. Without uh, thinking about the consequences of their actions, they did it out of passion. They did it out of out of their ego, out of their emotions. Whatever this is, this ten of swords that they did, they did it over and over and over again. You know, it's like lies to cover lies to cover lies. More and more and more. I'm trying to tell you something. Ooh, these folks up in in reverse. Mm -mm -mm. 
And with this hey man and this lovers, whatever this is that's been hidden about your family, it's like I feel like you already knew about that. With this hangman, hey man has a halo. Hey man sees and hears everything. But this is like getting downloads. So you don't have the physical proof, but you know that's because it's been kept hidden. It's about to come too. Come, let's see, let's see, let's see. Spirit, what's this message for my collective? Yep. Yeah. That could be a literal death too, as well. Take it how it resonates. Hmm. Maybe you predicted this. Maybe you knew this. I don't know. Page of Wands, new beginning. Somebody betrayed you for a new beginning, for a new opportunity. Hmm. Somebody could even wanted your job. Want you know whatever you do online. Somebody could have betrayed you just to try to take that over. Or maybe they wanted you to start over. Quit flying. Ooh, I almost got away. Look at this. Seven of Swords in reverse. Baby, baby, baby. That shit went flying over there. I almost caught it before it fell off the table. I did catch it before it fell off the table. So, this is being caught. Whatever they was doing in the darkness to get this new opportunity, it was foiled. Five of Swords. Oh, that's the Five of Swords. Okay, so what if somebody was... I don't know why I thought the Seven. Okay, Five of Swords. So whatever this person was trying to manipulate, trying to uh, come in between to sabotage something for you. That's what they wanted to do. They wanted to sabotage this new beginning for you. Oh, wow. They wanted to sabotage whatever this is you're working on in your Eight of Pentacles. It's, it's, it's abundant for you. It's creative. It's working for you. It's bringing you in finances. It's bringing you in wealth and prosperity. And it's quality. You hear me? And it's going to offer you a new opportunity. They did not want that for you. Oh, wow. So it's like if they gave you the money, you really would have took off. So instead of you, instead of them giving you your pinnacles, you, you made a decision to go ahead and, and create your own financial stability. You hear me? From, from the gifts that God has given you with your own hands. Come on, spirit. Mm, listen, they celebrated way too soon. They celebrated way too soon, and whatever they sent out is coming right back to them. You see those souls are turned upside down? Back towards that person. Thank you. Ooh, we. King of Pentacles and the Three of Swords. King of Pentacles came out in the other deck when I was playing around before I even started. It was a King of Pentacles. Mm-hmm. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Heartbreak. Three of Swords. Betrayal. Uh, interfering in your relationships. Interfering in your job. Interfering in your in your um, relationship. I said that. In your relationships and in, in any kind of interactions. This is somebody that wants to interfere. Listen, they did not want you to have this victory. You hear me? You get it anyway. Because see, what God gives you, no man can take away. I'm telling you, these people thought that by holding this from you, that they were going to be in control of your life in some way. Or that they were going to have your life in some way. This is, very, this is envy and jealousy. This is covet. This is somebody that wanted what you had. Spirit, period. This is somebody that was in your own family, in your own home, that was working against you to take from you. Come on, spirit. What's this message? This is somebody that turned people against you. Thank you, spirit. And now they're ashamed. They feel guilty. They feel regretful, remorseful. You know, because death is staring them in the face. And they know why. They know why death is here. They know why these endings are here for them. They know exactly why. They know what they did. Spirit, what's this message? King of Cups in reverse. Come on now. Liar, cheater, manipulator. Pretending to love you. Only if opportunists I'm hearing. Whew, I heard an F boy. That's what I heard. That's what I heard. An F boy. Mm -hmm. 
king of cups could be male or female take it how it resonates it could be a woman in in their masculine energy don't you know hey rest the rolls as needed king of cups look the fool mm-hmm Nine of Cups, Eight of Swords. Somebody wants to take a leap of faith and come and apologize to you, but they're stuck. They can't do shit because they're stuck in all the shit that they've done. All the shit that they did out of their emotions. This is literally somebody peeing on themselves. You hear me? Blinded. Confused, can't make no move, can't do shit because they they trapped in all the manipulation and the lies and the deceit that they put out. How can they turn around? How can they even come towards you knowing they are there, what they've done? And other people knowing what they've done. Listen. You're over it. They know it, but they feel trapped. Listen. They want to come to you, Empress. They really do. Because what they tried to do, God said no. God said that is not your portion. God said that is not what I have in store for you. People trying to call judgment in your life, trying to dictate how your life is gonna go. Can you believe it? But they but they forget who's in control of their life. Wanna play God? I can't make it up. They watching you, they know you're very God and you're very protected, and they know you bouncing. They know you're moving in a new direction. They know it. They know you're very guarded towards them. They know that you had to defend yourself time and time again. You were hurt mentally, physically from these people. You had to fight these people. You had to fight battles that weren't yours. And they watched to see if it worked. Watching to see if it worked. You see who it is. You know who it is. This is you. You know who it is. You're looking right at them. You see them. Wanting to control you. Cold. Closed off energy. Somebody literally wanting to control the narrative of your life. How you move. How people see you. What what you can have and what you can't have. This is what somebody somebody literally watches you. Your every single move. And anything that you're trying to do. Anything that they, they can see coming towards you. They want to block it. It's not working. And they're about to be put on display. These people are about to be humbled. There's endings coming. Spirit, what's going on here? Ooh, look, y'all. <coughs> you're off of this. You're leaving. Chariot awaits, ma'am. Sir, you're moving away from all these energies. Listen, because judgment is here, baby. Everyone will be judged. Everyone. For their actions. Spirit, what else? <clears throat> what else, Spirit, before I close this out? Because I got something to do. It's the pentacles. What's yours is yours. The gift that the universe has for you is yours. And can't nobody take it from you. Like I did, I said in my other reading, people listen and it's coming quickly. People feel like they took your birthright. They took your destiny by, by withholding from you. They felt like they had some kind of control in how far you were going life. God said, I don't think so. I don't think so. You ain't in control of nothing. Only thing you, can, you ain't in control of is that karma that's coming for that ass. Tell them about the spirit. Yep, all that celebration, all that, mm-hmm. That's coming. That's coming. It's coming. Spirit, anything else before I close this out? What's this? <laughs> it's coming. It's coming. All right, y'all. That's your message. I'll see you. Deuces. <laughs>